Hi, I am Dr. Subhana Gurunath and I am a fertility specialist practicing in Cloud9 Maleshwara. So this is another uh, common misconception that the more the embryos we transfer, the greater are the pregnancy rates. Now this is definitely not true. So if we transfer more than three embryos into the uterus, pregnancy rates, yes, you do get some good pregnancy rates, but then it's at the cost of very high chance of multiple pregnancy, especially higher order multiples. So today IVF has come a full circle. We all want you to take home one healthy child. And the motto today is that multiple pregnancy is no longer considered to be a success. So usually in none of our centers, we transfer more than two embryos. Our pregnancy rates are the same as transferring more than three embryos and we have no IVF triplets. So it's important to reduce the number of embryos that we are transferring in order to reduce the morbidity of children. So if there is higher order multiples, there are high chances of having complications during pregnancy such as miscarriages, early preterm births, so the babies tend to be born less than 28 weeks and tend to spend many weeks in the nursery and have a lot of perinatal morbidity and mortality. So instead of transferring multiple embryos, it's better to transfer one or two freeze the others and then transfer the others subsequently. So how many embryos are transferred again depends upon what your age is, which attempt of IVF you are doing and what is the quality of the embryos that you have. So if you are young and you have a lot of good quality embryos, it's always better to transfer only one or two embryos.